up for sale from Red Vale RV is this fresh arrival Ace Jubilee Statesman four berth caravan. This caravan's just arrived in New Zealand and as such, we've put a brand new Warren of Fitness on her. Fresh registration, had all the power points changed to New Zealand sockets with a fresh electrical Warren of Fitness. New Zealand LPG certified with a brand new nine kilo LPG bottle. We've also had this caravan through our workshop. It's had a full service to make sure everything is working as it should be. Purpose of this video is to give the caravan a good going over. So anybody who can't come to our yard north of Auckland knows exactly what type of caravan they're getting if they're purchasing it remotely. We've got over 45 caravans in stock here at Redvale RV. You can check out our website www.redvalerv.com and here we go. So this is the 2007. It weighs 1200 kilos and it's seven meters long. This size caravan is super easy to tow. Very easy to maneuver by hand if you need, being the single axle. It is a four berth, sleeping four adults comfortably. Externally and internally, it's in lovely order. I'm gonna go over this side here now, to point out any uh, bumps and bruises I can find. Keeping in mind, it is a 2007, it is not brand new, so there is gonna be some marks here and there. All right, the paintwork is in good order. There is a couple of tiny little uh, stone chips and things on the paintwork. It's actually kind of hard to fault down here. There's a couple of specks where the paint is missing just here and there, those two little dots. It's got alloy wheels with good tyres on it. A couple of paint scratches and things down there. Below here on the, there is thin paint there where somebody has maybe buffed it a little bit much. Other than that, this side's absolutely lovely around to the front end. Pinstriping on the front at the top there is faded and it's faded on the corners there as well. Of course, that is just cosmetic. All right, around to this side here. This side here is also in really good order. A couple of uh, pin dents here and there. There's a little dent down the bottom there, just on the skirt. It's just a cosmetic skirt. And there's some paint missing up there. Other than that, she's in good order. Around to the rear of the caravan. Couple of little scuffs on the bumper corners. Uh, there's a little bit of tape residue left over from the English number plates, which we can get off. And a little bit of dirt on the back there, which we'll just obviously clean off. And down the bottom corner there, there's a couple of marks on the bumper. Other than that, in good orders. So before we jump on inside, we're just going to stick our head underneath the camper. Look at just how lovely the chassis is. Solid chassis and a really solid floor under there. There's good tyres as well. These caravans are fully insulated, so the floor is even insulated, the roof's insulated, the walls. So these are super warm in, in winter. They've also got double glazing. So all the windows are double glazed. Also had the added, added bonus of blackout blinds, which are thermally insulated on the windows, which is up here. It's thermally insulated. Also keeps the sun out. All right, we're gonna step on in. Previous owner's artwork is included. This caravan does have fake wood floors fitted throughout. It also has removable carpets that you can put in that are professionally fitted to this caravan. I'm gonna step on in. So to the front left here, we've got our front lounge. This can be used as two single beds or this entire area folds down and you sleep this way and you make yourself a queen size bed. That hutch in the middle, the top half of that hutch there can actually come out of the way so you can sleep in this entire area. Below the seats there is storage and above us here there is storage all the way around. This area is lit by 12 volt lighting or our skylight. 
The Skylight also has a blackout blind and a fly screen as well. All of these windows, I'll show you here, have got fly screens as well as blackout blinds. Now remember this caravan is a 2007, so some of the fly screens might have minor holes in them, but they're all in working order. Right, the interior is in really good order. Couple of marks on the edge of the wood, um, as to be expected with the 2007. Good sized kitchen. We've got our three-way fridge, which runs off LPG or your mains. It's also got a little freezer box in the top. Up the top there is your freezer unit. Over to your kitchen bench area here. So this is removable. Get stuff out of the way. Hot cold tap. Hot water is provided by an onboard hot water cylinder, which runs off either LPG or your mains power. Over to our beautiful belling oven and hob. This caravan here has three gas burners and one mains power burner. Down to toaster grill and our nice sized gas oven there. Stowed away in here is a trestle table. This table here slides out and you can set that up in this area here. So there is space for dining for six. Okay, once again, overhead storage. This cupboard up here is a pretty special one. You can use this as a pantry, or a lot of people use it as a TV cupboard because it opens both sides. So you can watch television. If you've got a TV up there from the lounge, you'll turn it around and watch it from the master bedroom. Up the back here, we've got mains power and 12 volt to run your television. Okay. You notice we've got a bench extension here. This bench extension actually closes to shut the bedroom off. If I look back here, there's also a Constantina door comes out of here to shut your bedroom off. So if you don't make your bed one day and you've got guests coming over, they don't have to see your mess in there. Got some brilliant size storage here with a gas heating system, which also runs off mains power if you're plugged into mains also. All right, through to our bedroom area. The bedroom area consists of a permanent double bed. This bed lifts up, and I'm going to show you that shortly. Space above you, plenty of storage. Another skylight, so you can look at the stars at night, or put the blackout blind across and keep it nice and dark. We've got a vanity area, hot cold tap. You can do your teeth before you go to bed. Into our separate shower and toilet. So we've got a cassette toilet there hot cold shower, all your, your drainage goes down there. This door here shuts off your loo so the toilet doesn't get wet while you're having a shower. Now below this bed, this caravan comes with two very large awnings. All under this bed, look at this, this is all awning. That bag there, that bag there, it's also your removable carpets. You've got all your posts here. Now think of these as a freebie, they, we're giving them for free. We don't have time to erect all the awnings that the caravans comes with. But it looks as though all the bits and bobs are there. Um, and those awnings are absolutely monstrous. Full room awnings. So as I said, we've just had this caravan service to make sure all the appliances are working as they should be. We also go around and make sure that the caravan is nice and dry and solid. Here at Redvale RV, we also fit accessories. So... We can fit solar systems, self-containment certifications. We can fit reversing cameras, all sorts. We also arrange finance, and we're happy to take trade-ins, whatever you have. If you've got a car or a camper you want to trade, just let us know. We're strictly by appointment only for viewing, so give us a uh, call on the phone number attached to the listing. Or jump onto our website, redvalerv.com. And we'll be happy to help. Thank you so much for watching.